Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today's video is a super exciting part one of a two-part collab and um, with my beautiful soul sister Anki. If you don't know who Anki is, which I'm pretty sure all of you will do, um, I will have her channel and video linked in the description box below. She is just, just the most wonderful person. I absolutely adore her. She is just such a dear friend to me and I love her to bits. And yeah, we thought we would collab again doing our build your own palettes, um, which both of us love to do. Anki is especially amazing at doing these um, build your own palettes. So we thought we would go with a Valentine's theme, considering Valentine's is just around the corner. So yeah guys, if you'd like to see me creating my perfect Valentine, Valentine's palette, then just keep on watching. Okay, so excuse the, uh, the background, it's a plastic tablecloth, just because I have a feeling it's going to get messy. And so I'm gonna start with kind of the reddish matte shades so one's a pinky red and orangey red um these are all lethal cosmetics first one is fahrenheit and you'll have to excuse the shadows this is the only place i can film with the pup around at the moment um so that's fahrenheit and then we have terminus and Terminus looks like this, more of a pinky red. And then next up is Frantic. And this is Frantic, more of a deeper, deeper red. And Unity. Ooh. Okay, it's more of like a purp deep purpley red. Oh, um, then Cascade. And finally, Quick Save. Okay, well, first off, Quick save is not going to go. Ooh. I'm going to put both Unity, which is uh, this one, and Frantic. I'm going to put them aside. So that's those two there. And I'm thinking, should I go with, I'm going to put Fahrenheit in the maybe pile as well. Um, so Cascade and Terminus, I'm going to pop them out. Right, so let's go in with the kind of ready, orangey kind of shimmers. Um, and these also are all uh, lethal cosmetics. So this one here is Euphoria. And I think this is one of my favorite shades from lethal look at that um and then arcade it's very pretty oh and then we have backdraft i'm not doing a very good job of holding these under the camera am i i'm in a completely different space than i'm used to and then Covet, Ooh. <laughs> throwing that on the table there, there's Covet, Ooh. and then finally for the red shimmers, this is Echo, Let's see if I can get a relatively clean finger here, <laughs> and this here is Echo, 
Oh, I definitely, definitely want to add Arcade. So I'm going to pop, that's Arcade there, this one here. Um, oh, I think that's, or is that? No, I am going to pop Euphoria in the maybe pile. So this one here. And then Echo, Covet and Backdraft are being popped out. Right, excuse the stained back of my hands, but that's what we're working with. Right, so I'm on to pink mats. I only have, bizarrely, three. I seem to have an awful lot of shimmers, um, but not as many mats. Um, so the first one I have here is from Terra Moons. It's Utopia. This is more of your pastel pink. Ooh. And then Sample Beauty, and this is called Tutu, one of their singles. Oh, that's a nice pink. And then from Lethal Cosmetics, we have Caps Lock. Ooh. Oh, I like all three of those. I am going to move all three of those into the maybe pile um, because they look beautiful. Okay, so now on to the pink shimmers. First one I've got is, I believe it's called Cindy. It's from Makeup by Lisa. Um, I really should just have put the names of the shades on the back. And this is Cindy. Oh, that is pretty. Um, and then we have Nectarine from the Pastel Roses. Can you see that sparkle and the shift in that? It is so stunning. I think actually under this light it's looking a bit better. Um, then we have Lychee also from the Pastel Roses. And I will pop that there. Oh, oh, crikey. Very sparkly and beautiful. And then next up we have Fiona from Titmouse Cosmetics. And um, it's a UK indie brand that I have recently discovered a liking for. And Oh, this is more of, this should have been in with the purples, really. <laughs> oh, that is pretty. And then next up from the Pastel Roses is Watermelon. And that there is Watermelon, so it's kind of pink and green shifting absolutely stunning I hope you can see that um, and then next up is pixie sticks from Davina cosmetics and uh, she looks like this oh that would be perfect in a corner shade oh and then finally enigma from the from Lethal Cosmetics, if I can talk. And pop that there. This one doesn't swatch so well. It does look lovely on the eyes though. Um, well, 100% I want both Watermelon from the Pastel Roses and Pixie Sticks from Davina Cosmetics. And do I want Nectarine as well? Or should I swap watermelon? Ooh. I think actually I'm going to take out watermelon and pop in nectarine. What should I pop? No, I'll just leave them both in for now. And mm. yeah, I think. Or should I? No, I am going to pop. Um. Cindy from Makeup by Lisa in the maybe as well. So that's that one there. So those two and then 
these two. Okay, so we are on to purple mattes. So the first up is Duchess from Makeup Geek. And well, it's very powdery. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that shade. That shade is stunning. I'm covered in sparkle from the shimmers. Obviously, these don't have sparkle in. They are mattes. <laughs> and then we have Eggplant from Sample Beauty. So I'm going to pop Eggplant here. Oh, that's pretty. I love the formula of Sample Beauty's eyeshadows. And then we have Night Call. This is from Lethal Cosmetics. So let's pop a bit of that there. Ooh. Ooh. Um. Hmm. And then Undone, also from Lethal Cosmetics. Another amazing shade. Ooh. Okay, then next up is Iron Grip from Menagerie Cosmetics. So let's pop that here. Ooh, it's also a very lovely colour. Okay, <laughs> um, this is going to be really tough. I, I appear to like... Um, pinks and purples. Um, so next up is Release from Lethal Cosmetics. And oh, it's really soft and pretty. God, I'm loving the colour story on my hand right now. And then we have Altitude, also from Lethal Cosmetics. And that looks, oh, oh, okay. Ooh. Hmm, yeah, this colour story in itself is beautiful. And then next up we have Heiress from Colourpop. And I'm throwing it around. Um, this is Heiress Colourpop. Another really beautiful shade. And then finally in this uh, collection here I have Cupcake Frosting from M Cosmetics. So let's... Pop that there. Oh, oh, I like that a lot. Okay, so I am going to. I'm going to pop in Duchess from Makeup Geek into the maybe pile, and also I am going to um, pop in Altitude, which is this one here, and. I do want to add Cupcake Frosting from M Cosmetics. I've got a couple of more um, pastel shades. And I think, oh, do I want to? Yeah, I'm going to pop Eggplant from Sample Beauty, which is this one here. I'm going to pop that in the maybe pile also. Oh, are there any other? No. Oh, I don't know. Um, right, release this one here. I'm going to pop, or am I? Yes, this one here, release from Lethal Cosmetics. That's also going in the maybe pile. Okay, is that it? Or is that? Oh, this is so hard. Um, I've got a couple of deep shades. I'm also going to put Night Call, um, which is this one here, from Lethal Cosmetics in the Maybe pile, and pop the others aside. Okay, so a slight um, change here, because I want to do them up my arm. So the first one I have is Revolve from Lethal Cosmetics, and I'm going to start that up here. I'm trying to... Let me just plunk that there to do it. 
Um, so this one here is Revolve. And then we have, I do love that shade. And then next up is Red Grape. This is from the Pastel Roses UK. And this is all oh, those two shades. So I wish I could just put all of these shades in. I would be happy with that. Um, and then we have Spirit from Lethal Cosmetics. doesn't swatch as well but it's not as bad on the eyes and the next shade I have here is synth also from lethal cosmetics Ooh. such a pretty shade it's definitely one of my favorites I think from Lethal Cosmetics and then next up is Lavender this is from the Pastel Roses UK and that's that here oh that's so pretty um and then Starlight, also from the Pastel Roses UK. And this one's a little bit of a flakier formula, but it looks beautiful. Crikey, everything I touch is going to be sparkly today. <laughs> um, next up is Calx from Cleona Cosmetics. And if I can find a finger that's not shining to the heavens. Um, is this one here. Oh, such a beautiful shade. Such a beautiful shade. I think I'm going to run out of arm space before before I run out of uh, shadows here um, so next one I have here is Winter Garden from Sydney Grace and oh oh I love this oh look at that oh, this is going to be so tough so tough to choose um <laughs> And then we have Constellation, also from the Pastel Roses. I have a feeling there's going to be quite a few from the Pastel Roses in Anki's palette because she is a huge fan of their shadows. It's another one of the slightly um, chunkier formulas. And... Another one from the Pastel Roses is Blueberry. And Blueberry looks like this. I'm going to move my arm down a little bit so that you can see the rest of them when they go on. There's only three more purple shimmers. So yeah, we've got this. It's all good. I think I might even, will I be able to fit them all in? No, of course not. Um, the next up we have Cupcake. This is from the Pastel Roses UK. And it looks like this. Such a pretty shade. And Riverside, also from the Pastel Roses. And seems to be a slightly oilier formula, but look at that, that is beautiful. And then the last for the purpley shimmers is Kylie, it's from Titmouse Cosmetics.
a little bit crumbly. I think I dug in a little bit too much there. So that is Kylie. Right, guys, which ones of these do we want to pick? Well, I definitely want a red grape from the Pastel Roses. So that's that one there. That's in the maybe pile. And um, I think I want Calcsin from Cleona Cosmetics. So this one here. Add a bit of difference. Um, I want to add, I want to add Kylie, which is the last one up here. Um, that's from Titmouse Cosmetics, or do I? Yeah. Um, yeah. Are there any others I want to add from this lot? Okay, I'm going to add Winter Garden from Sydney Grace, which is this one here. I think I'm also going to add Blueberry from the Pastel Roses, which is this one here. And then pop the others aside. Okay, and back to this angle, I have some kind of special shades I want to look at incorporating for like inner corner highlights or whatever. So I think I'm going to use the palm of my hand. Um, so the first one is Eon from Terra Moons. And oh, look at that. It's got a really beautiful pink green shift absolutely stunning and then we have Shuggies from Davina Cosmetics and that there is Shuggies beautiful the next one I have is Lux from Cleona Cosmetics it's one of the series 2 iridescent multi-chromes and pop that another amazingly beautiful beautiful colour and then Arsenic from Lethal Cosmetics and that there is Arsenic it's not one of my favourites from uh, Lethal I have to say and then the final one for this section is Tallulah from Davina Cosmetics. Um, I'm hoping this is going to go because I absolutely love the look of this. I'm so desperate to try that on my eyes. Look at those. Right, I think I'm going to add Lux from Cleona Cosmetics, which is this one here. And And I'm going to add uh, Tallulah from Davina Cosmetics. And do I add one more? Yes, I think I am going to add Shuggies from Davina Cosmetics, um, which is the one in the middle there. Okay. Okay, guys, so I have this just empty palette here. I want to start building my colour story. Um, so shades I know I definitely want in. So this is Duchess from Makeup Geek. I know I want that in. And, and Cupcake Frosting from M Cosmetics. I think that is going to go perfectly. Um, Arcade from Lethal Cosmetics. That I can always change it around if need be. Um, I definitely want to add Nectarine from the Pastel Roses UK. And eggplant from Sample Beauty. I'm gonna pop his hairs in there. Um, okay, and 
I'm going to pop in Frantic from Lethal Cosmetics. And I definitely want Tutu from Sample Beauty. And where are we going? Uh, Pixie Sticks from Davina Cosmetics. Yes. Uh, Unity from Lethal Cosmetics. Um, Calx from Cleona Cosmetics. How is this looking? Uh, do, do, do. Winter Garden from Sydney Grace. How's this looking so far? Hmm. Um, I want to add Cindy from Makeup by Lisa. And Lux from Cleona Cosmetics. Um, I'm going to pop in Kylie from Titmouse. Tallulah from Davina. Utopia from Terra Moons. Uh, Release from Lethal Cosmetics. What do I not have? Um, I'm going to pop in Nightcall from Lethal Cosmetics. What am I missing here? What am I missing? Um, adding in Shuggies from Davina Cosmetics. What is missing? What is missing? I think I'm going to pop in Red Grape. Now I'm not sure, I'm not sure, I think actually I'm going to, do I want to take that one out? I might take out Eggplant and pop in Caps Lock, is that looking better? Um, Hmm. Okay, this is this one's tough. This one is tough. So I don't think I need both of these or do I? No, I don't. I am going to take out I'm going to take out Unity and I'm going to pop in going to pop in Fahrenheit, I think. How's that looking? Is that looking good? I think so. I think so. Ooh. Okay, guys, this is such a tough one. This is such a tough one. Actually, I'm not going to put Fahrenheit in. I'm going to exchange that for, or am I, Altitude, or, or Crikey. Do I want that one in there? Oh, no, I think Fahrenheit, Does Fahrenheit go. This is so tough. I've got one two, three deepening shades. Hmm. Okay, I think I am going to... I'm going to pop in Altitude from Lethal Cosmetics. Right, let's sit back and have a look at this. I'm going to... No, I don't want to take out Kylie. Should I take 
up red grape and put in Euphoria. Yeah, I'm going to pop Euphoria from Lethal Cosmetics in there and take out red grape from the pastel roses and then have another look. So what do we think of this colour story? Yeah, so I think this one does have to come out. I don't think... Just give that another swatch and just say, yeah. So I'm going to take out um, Tallulah from Davina Cosmetics and I'm going to change that for red grape, I think. Or am I? Hold on. Yes, so I'm going to change that for red grape and I think, I think that's it. Okay, guys, so this is the finished Valentine's Day palette. I don't know what I'm going to call it. I'm going to have a think and let you guys know. So I will come back. You will see me, as in me, me, not just my hands. And I will swatch these up my arm just to show you what the colour story looks like swatched out. So, yes, just hold on a moment and I will be right back. Okay, guys, so... This is the finished palette. I have swatched it out. This is my perfect Valentine palette. And the three rows, the three top rows or first three rows are swatched here. And then those five, that's the bottom row there. So this is my perfect Valentine palette swatched out. I am super excited to share looks with you guys, so if you'd like to see the two looks then you will need to tune in on Thursday um, because that's when part two of our club will be going live. Um, but yes, super, super happy with this colour story. I love it and I'm so grateful that Anki wanted to collab with me again. Our Build Your Own Palette collabs are just so special to me. I absolutely love doing it. It's so much fun. And it's what we want to do, isn't it? A colour story that we put together ourselves. One that we love every shade. So, yeah, guys. I am going to leave this there. Again, if you don't know who Anki is, if you haven't checked her out, head on over there now. Subscribe like comment she deserves so much more love than she gets she is amazing and if you enjoy my channel you most definitely will enjoy Anki's channel so all that's left to say is thank you so much for joining me today if you've liked this video please do give it a like um, that really helps me out. If you are new, if you are over from Anki's channel, hi, I'm Steph, huge lover of colourful makeup, if you haven't guessed that already. Um, I love to support indie brands, that is my my passion, where my heart lies. And yeah, so if, if that sounds like something you'd be interested in, then please do hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so that YouTube notifies you every time I upload a video. So guys, that's it from me for today. Anki, thank you so, so much for collabing with me again. You know how much I love you, girl. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you for joining me. I hope you're all having a great day, great evening, wherever you are and whatever you're doing. I hope you're taking care of yourselves. I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye. Thank you.